Hello and welcome to today's math lesson. Now today, as usual, we will take our small board here and review very quickly the shapes that we've studied before and then revise something that we did the last lesson uh, so it's clear and we can remember what you've done. So I'm going to draw the shapes. You have to say what they are. What's this? Good. What's this? Good. What's this? Good. What's this? Okay, great. Square. Circle. Triangle. Rectangle. Okay, so these are the shapes. Now, we did something to them the last time, which is whole and then half. Whole, half, whole, half, whole, half, okay? So here, this is a whole, and these are halves, or half, okay? So half, 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 okay? So half is, putting, is breaking something into two equal parts two equal parts. So if we do this, for example, this is not a half. So this is not a half because they are not equal parts. Okay, so half is only when they are equal parts, like this, for example. So these two are equal, so we can call it a half. Okay, now we did a bit more than halves for the other shapes like square, circle, and rectangle, we had something called quarter, quarter. Now again, quarter has to have four equal shapes. So we call this quarter here. Now, is this a quarter? No, because these shapes are bigger. These sides are bigger. So here, I'll draw it again. Try to make it a proper half. Okay, so see, all these shapes are the same. So we can call it a quarter. Quarter, because we have four pieces. We write four, four and one. Four pieces of a whole. Okay? Rectangle. So four pieces, and they are the same size and the shape. Okay, so call this quarter. Four pieces of a whole. Okay, so these are the divisions that we did the last time. So we have whole half and quarter. Okay, so whole is one half is two pieces of a whole quarter is four pieces of a whole okay great now let's go move on to the course book the pupils book and pick up where we left off the last lesson now before we pick up where we left off we had a small homework which was draw lines to each rectangle to quarter each rectangle. Quarter each rectangle differently. So I did the first one for you. And you have to do the rest. So here. Let's go ahead. I'll do the rest. Okay, so this is how you have uh, the rectangles. Uh, you can color them. You can bring the colors out and color them whatever way in whatever way you like. But for myself, I'm gonna leave them like this, just so the divisions are very clear and uh, understandable for me. Okay. So if you did it this way, that's great. I can't think of other ways that you can uh, quarter each rectangle, but if you did, uh, make sure to show me in the comments because I'll add that the ways that you can quarter a rectangle okay halves and quarters 
The whole square is red. The half square is red. Quarter of the square is red. Okay, I'll do that here as well. So I'll draw three squares. One, two, three. Okay, so here, let's do this. Here, the whole square is blue. And here, half the square is blue. And here, quarter square is blue. So here, whole. Here, half. And here, quarter. So which one is more? One. Which one is the least or less? It's quarter. So quarter is less than half. And half is less than one. One is more than half. And half is more than quarter. Okay? So again, here, a whole square is blue. Half square is half. Quarter of the square is blue. Alright? Great. Let's move on. Here, write half or quarter to show each fraction. Okay, so here in A, is this half or quarter? What do you think? Half. So you write half. Okay, now I want you to go ahead and pause the video, answer these on your own, and then answer them with me and check your answers. Okay, great. Go ahead and pause the video now. Okay, if you play, pause the video and answer the questions, let's answer them now together. B, one, two, three, four. So that's quarter. Okay, here, one, two. That's half. Here, one, two. That's half. Here, one, two. Again, half. Here, one, two, three, four. That's quarter. Okay, here, one, two. So that's half. One, two, three, four. So that's quarter. One, two, three, four. So that's quarter again. Okay, so these are halves and quarters. Now, I would recommend that you color them. As usual, you, you can take a, you can take out each uh, different color for each half or quarter, so that's not white uh, and looks much nicer if you color it differently. This is green. Okay, great. And then blue. You can color these halves blue, or we could just use different colors for them. different colors as well. Mm, I use red. These are different colors. Um, I'll use purple for this one here. Again, as usual, make sure you don't go outside of the lines and uh, you color the, the halves or quarters neatly so they look nice. Uh, okay, not orange because it's already orange. I'll use a different color. It's just light green. I have light green here. I'll use this one. Next up is, uh, no, I don't want to use your green again. Let's see. 
think I have black. Yeah, black's good as well. Used black a couple of times before. And it looked nice as well back then. Let's do that again. Okay. Uh, let's use orange for this one. Uh, again, remember the last time I told you to say the colors as we color them? So we have orange and then blue. This is blue. Or light blue. Red. Okay. Um, I'm not going to use green. Orange. Oops, I broke it. Okay. Brown. Brown. Okay, good. Green. This is green. Green or turquoise, I think. Between green and blue, I think. Red. Okay, good. Now again, we can use um, let's use green here. This is very light green. Orange. And red. Okay, so I can do this, and uh, we've got a colorful page instead of the one that we had before. See, I went outside of the line here, but you can do a much better job and uh, stay in the lines. Okay. Okay, great. Now we can move on to the next page. I will put the colors right next to me here because we still need them for this next exercise. Okay, color all. The whole shapes red. So what is red? I have red. Color all the half shapes blue. Color all quarter shapes green. So I have green, red, and blue. I'll put the other colors away so they don't come in the way. Okay. Great. So let's move on. I'll put the colors here so we can uh, draw. Color them. Color all the whole shapes red. So let's start with red and color all the whole shapes first. Okay. Uh, this is a whole shape. It's only one. So let's color all of it red. Okay. Make sure you don't go outside of the lines again. Uh, that's the most important part of this exercise. Now, if you don't have the book, you can simply draw the shapes here, and then pause the video, draw the shapes, and uh, then you can do it. Uh, you can color them uh, with me. Now, I'll answer the first one. Now, I want you to go ahead and pause the video. Try to say which one is a whole and which one is a half. So, like this. This is whole. This is half. This is half. So, if you see whole, draw right one. If you see half, draw uh, right half. Don't color just yet. Color with me. We'll color together. But for now, just write one or half. So go ahead and pause the video now. Okay, so if you pause the video and you play it again, here are the answers. Quarter, quarter, one, two, three, four. It's quarter, one, two, that's half. One, 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 two, three, four, that's quarter. Here, this is one. Okay, now that we're done with that, it's time to color the ones with a hole or just one. Uh, there, one. Just gonna color this one. Okay, color this one.
Okay, great. Now color all the half shapes blue. So here, blue. So we're gonna color these, this one, or well, these ones blue. So we're gonna color all of them blue, not just one half. Okay, half again, so it's blue. Okay, again. Half and then uh, another half. And then that's it. Now color all the quarter shapes green. So let's color these green. Oops, I went outside the line. Make sure you don't go outside the line and that will make it much look much, much uh, nicer. See, I'm trying to not go outside of the line, but I think I did again. You will see. Okay, and this one is quarter as well. So, green. Okay, and next up, this last one is green as well. Okay, great. We missed one, one, one hole here, which is red. So let's do that right now. Okay, that's pretty much it. Okay, great. Now we can move on to the next exercise, which is assessment. Color half of these ribbons. Make sure the patterns are different. Color quarter of these ribbons. Make each pattern different. So here, we're going to either color half, and the other one is color quarter of these shapes. Now I'm only going to do this one, or in just one of these here, so I can just show you how to do it. Color half, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So how many do we have to color? Four, because eight, this is eight. What's half of eight? Four. Okay, so we're going to color four, so we need four different colors. Mm, okay, these look okay. So we have to color them in different patterns. Okay, so they don't have to be, they have to be different and not the same. Uh, the first one is the one I'll do for you here. This one's orange. Mm -hmm. This one's red. This one blue. And this one green. Okay, uh, the other patterns have to be different, so maybe you color these four and not color these four, or maybe color off all of these and not these, just to make it uh, look different. So you can color them in whatever uh, pattern that you like, and then move on to the quarter, and color quarter of these shapes. Not four, but less, which is quarter. Okay? So, again, let's quickly review what you've done in this lesson, which is whole, half, and quarter. So a whole square, half square, and quarter square. I hope you learned something new today. 
let me know if you need any questions or any, you know, if you have any questions or you need any help and i'll be glad to help you thank you very much for watching and i'll see you next time goodbye